I love that interactive storytelling element. Um, you know, everything from Halo games to Pokemon to Elder Scrolls, there's a world to explore and a story to be told. It's like you're immersed in a new world. It's like you're not, you're not on Earth anymore. You can create another life for yourself and so suddenly you get on your computer and the power is in your hands. You can fly, you can cast spells, you can slaughter everybody if you're having a bad day. When the graphics are superb, it makes it feel real, you know? And I just like the altar experience. Well, my favorite video game would, as you would guess, Madden, or uh, 2K. League of Legends, I've been playing for all of my high school and college career, essentially. Um, as far as single player, though, I have to give it to the Elder Scrolls Skyrim. Elder Scrolls V Skyrim is, is definitely one of my favorite games of all time. I mean, huge world to explore, amazing stories, um, dragons, I mean, dragons. <laughs> Instead of it just being kids, it will be a, the adults, everyone in the family, as like, a, they'll make it a family event. You say, hey, me and my friends are gonna be playing this game over the weekend, hanging out on Skype, you wanna join us? With virtual reality, I think just expanding on like the the um, the altered dimension. It's literally like you are in the game. I think gaming is going to try to f take what it has and make it more accessible for its audiences, whether they're at home or on the go. I'm Juwan Moore. Hendrick DeSmith. I'm Matthew Grimm. I am an avid gamer and a media communications major here at Houghton.